What's up, boys and girls? Coach Nick here, and today we're talking about trembling again. Right, first up, I've got one point to make here. I get quite a few DMs from guys who've been running trend uh, and other kind of gear, and they say, Coach, what sort of PTC should I run for my uh, cycle I'm near the end? And I just want to put it out there don't start your cycle unless you have serms on hand and you know what PTC you're going to be doing. You have no idea what curveballs life are going to be throwing at you. you. You can't be going through your cycle without a backup. For whatever reason, you might have to stop. You need your serms on hand so you can immediately deploy them after the, uh, the, you know, the waiting time for, the, for it to clear your system. That's by the by. What I really wanted to talk about was Trembolone's metabolites. If you're taking Tren and you're going to be blasting and then coming off and doing a PTC, Trembolone isn't the thing for you. Trembolone has two metabolites of note here called 17 alpha and 17 beta Trembolone. These metabolites can stick around your system for three months on average. This is on average. They can be guys who metabolize it quicker so they can come off quicker. And then we guys who metabolize it a lot slower. I personally have seen blood work of up to six months of someone who's using Tren and was still suppressed. Because 17 alpha and 17 beta are both very strong they both have very strong binding affinities for the androgen receptor, which will suppress you. So even though you stop pinning, and even though the enanthate or ACE, uh, ACE acetate ester has been cleaved fully, and the parent compound has fully left your system, these metabolites will be sticking around, suppressing you. So if you're blasting and cruising, sorry, if you're uh, doing a PTC after trend, I heavily recommend dropping to a TRT dose and just cruising on that for a few months. Ideally, I would like you to cruise for three months after your last Tremblone injection. Allow those metabolites to clear for at least on average, and then attempt your PTC. That's not to say that you're gonna be successful because you might be one of the uh, slow me metabolizers. It may last six months in your system. So you'll often hear me say, don't use Tren. And that's because a lot of guys don't know what the fuck they're doing. I don't want lads going out there, following Daddy D Tren's advice, pinning Tren, <laughs> and then trying to PTC, losing all their gains, getting fat, getting gyno rebound from high E2 to testosterone ratios, fucking themselves up because they don't understand the compound. If you're going to use Tren, blast and cruise. Do not, do not attempt to PTC. It will not work. Or the vast majority of you will not, it won't work for you. You won't recover. So I just want to put it out there. Like and share this video because I don't think this is talked about often enough. I know Derek talks about it, but... Still get the questions, guys. So thanks for watching. Share, like, all that good stuff. I appreciate all the support. And that's it for now. Coach Nikel. Peace.